Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Shravya. Today for my fifth recipe of Italian cuisine, I'm going to show you how to make really easy and delicious bombalunis. These are basically fried donuts with a filling inside. I'm going to be filling it with some custard. You can also use some whipped cream or any kind of berry jam. Strawberry jam goes really well. Uh, and these are coated with some uh, cinnamon sugar and with some powdered sugar. Um, in case you do not want to fry your donuts, you can also bake these at 180 degrees Celsius for 10 to 15 minutes or until the tops are brown. That's it. So let's get started. In a large bowl, we're going to take 3 4th cup of warm milk. Make sure the milk is lukewarm. We're going to activate our yeast here. To this add in 3 tablespoons of sugar. Mix until the sugar dissolves. To this add in 2 teaspoons of active dry yeast. Mix until the yeast dissolves. Now let this rest for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes the top becomes slightly foamy. To this add in 1 tablespoon of oil. To this add in half a teaspoon of salt. Half teaspoon vanilla essence. Vanilla essence can be overpowering if you add too much, so make sure you maintain the measurement. To this, gradually add in 2 cups of all purpose flour. You need to use all purpose flour here. If you use whole wheat flour, it might end up being slightly hard. Mix everything. Use your hands once the dough becomes manageable. Now grease your hands with some oil. Rub the oil all over your dough. Fold it into a smooth ball. Cover it with a kitchen towel and let it rest for at least 90 minutes in a warm place. We're going to prepare the filling in the meantime. Take about 1 4th cup of milk. To this add in about 3 large tablespoons of custard powder. Mix until there are no lumps. Now take 2 large cups of milk in a pot. To this add in some sugar to taste and let the milk warm up. Once the milk is warm add in your custard powder solution and let the mixture thicken. Once it starts to thicken keep it aside. It's been 90 minutes you can see the dough has doubled up. Now we are going to knead it one more time. Here we are trying to knock out all the air. With 2 cups of all purpose flour, we are going to get about 6 to 8 bombalunis depending on the size you go for. Once the dough comes back to its normal size, take some portion of the dough and make it into a really smooth ball. Avoid any cracks on the balls, otherwise the bombalunis won't look uniform. Now place it on a plate or a tray and let it rest for at least 30 to 40 minutes. It's been 40 minutes, our donuts have risen one more time. 
Now take a plate. Take about 3 large tablespoons of sugar. To this add in 1 teaspoon of cinnamon powder. Mix all of this together. Now that we're frying our donuts, there's no need to add any melted butter on top. The sugar is going to stick on its own. If you're baking your donuts, just brush with some melted butter on top before you coat them with the sugar. Place some oil on the heat and gently place your donut ball into it. Let it fry until it's evenly golden brown on both sides. Here we're taking very little oil in the pan. This gives that characteristic white line in the center where the donut is not touching the oil. Now once these are fried, put these on the cinnamon sugar and coat it really well. Dust with some powdered sugar. Make a slit on one side with a knife and using a piping bag fill in your custard. These donuts are going to be very hollow from the inside so make sure you're generous with your filling. If you're filling in some jam you can just use a spoon. If you're using whipped cream make sure the cream is whipped really well. That's it our bombalunis are ready. For more interesting recipes like this, like, share and subscribe to my channel. Not forget to hit the bell icon.